Enugu State. Mr. Speaker, this bill for an act to establish the Environmental Trust Fund charged with responsibility for imposing tax, managing and disposing the funds for environmental restoration, rehabilitation, conservation, research and education, and further related matters. Mr. Speaker, honorable colleagues, I believe that issues pertaining to the environment is very important in this country. And uh, if we go back, you will appreciate that Nigeria presently is suffering the consequences of impact on our environment. You, you may talk about farmers, people who are engaged in uh, animal husbandry, herders and all that. The migration and the massive migration, they're all related to environment. And we need to pay attention, and very well too, if we do not indirectly undermine, want to undermine ourselves. So I believe that the principle is good. But the point also to make is that it is very important that we align it with other existing structures. Uh, because from all indications, what he's saying that the source of funding for this is tax. Uh, then we need to say, say, okay, in what way is the ecological fund functioning? So there has to be an a realignment of all these elements. And uh, for me, if he had said that the source of funding would be ecological fund, I would say it's, it's, it's very prudent. I do not like any fund or any activity that is subject to whims and caprices of anybody. I don't like situations where it is at the discretion of anybody. And for me, ecological fund as presently constituted, there isn't a clear modus operandi for it. So I think during the interrogation at public hearing, I think it should go to second because there is no way, there's no act to find the mass construction on the face until it is on board, until you say what you want. It should be interrogated because the issue of environment is very important to Nigerians. Ecology, uh, the, the devastation on erosion, which predominantly happens in the southeast, you go to south-south, you see pollution. There is no regulation or any manner of attention that is posed to oil devastation. So I think that we need to have an approach to this. And the only way to come to that is when experts, the Nigerian people, the members of the public, are given opportunity to interrogate the principles and the associated provisions of the law. So I recommend it for second reading, uh, for, to that it should pass second reading. Thank you very much. Those in favor that the bill be read second and say aye. aye. Those against say nay. Yes. That is a bit.